How you doing guys? Today we have a 2017 Dodge Ram 1500. Customer lost the only key, so we're gonna create it from scratch. Let's start. By the way, if you like this type of videos, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm gonna use Lishi CY24 to pick the door lock, and then we can decode it and cut the key. So when I'm doing the Lishi, I'm trying to find any pin that doesn't have a spring, and I put a little bit of pressure and this is how I pick the pin. Uh, sometimes we'll have to come back to the same pin over and over again, uh, but any pin that I feel spring, I do not touch it, I just keep it the same way it is and I move to the next pin until there is no binding pins, that means everything is picked and the lock should turn. always want to keep the pressure on the leash you don't want to release the pressure because if you put you release the pressure you need to start over again and everything is picked like that now we can decode the key, so I'm going to use a software to do that. And uh, now I'm going to take uh, another fob and we're going to cut the blade. This is the emergency blade just to open the door. I'm going to use SEC E9, high security key machine. I'm going to go to search. I'm going to look for a key blank Y159, which is the blank with the eight cuts. Since we only have seven in the door, I'm going to put the first one as a number one. And then I'm going to put all the rest of the numbers that I read with the Lishi. And I'm going to hit OK and cut. I'm going to make it s the speed a little bit faster and it will start cutting. When it finished cutting, we can just uh, remove it, clean uh, the key and the clamp from all the metal shavings. We can test it on the door and it works perfectly. So now for the program, I'm going to use the uh, Hotel KM100. Um, and we have to connect the dongle underneath the OBD, underneath the steering column, which is right here. And this connects with Bluetooth to the machine. I'm gonna go to immobilizer. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna put the ignition, the fob, I'm gonna turn it two clicks to the on position without trying to start it. There is a security light. And when it finish, it will uh, start the car. I also turned on off the uh, radio. I'm going to go to uh, Dodge, then I'm going to go to Automatic Selection, I'm going to hit OK, it reads the vehicle information. We're going to hit fob key because it's not a push to start. We put the fob. We want to make sure we have the year making model and hit yes. It tells us to turn the ignition off and on again, but uh, we just to make sure that the engine is not running. So I just hit OK. I'm going to go to hot function. I'm going to go to key learning type two. And we're going to go to uh, key learning and we're going to hit start. It's going to do the whole process by itself. So it's going to read the pin code. It shows us two keys in the memory. It tells us to turn the ignition off, leave the key inside, and turn on the hazard lights, and hit OK. Now it tells us the pin code. We're going to hit OK. Yes. And it's going to say three learning succeeded. You want to program another key? I'm going to say no. And it's going to read the keys again. And at the beginning we had two. Now we have three. So now this key should work just fine. Let's test it out. Yeah, 
and see if it starts. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. Uh, please like and subscribe. And again, thank you very much for watching to the end of the video. Thank you.